basically give you, even if but basically they give you the watch. Were they almost the same tactical player? Uh, I want to tell you, match has been tough as expected on this level of competition. As far as I know, uh, we have nev never, in uh, except in underage categories down under 17, we have never beaten uh, Rwanda and Kigali. It's an intimidating place. They are very motivated uh, to show to Uganda that they have reached the level uh, to be better than us. Uh, we respect this. We played against a generation that, in history of uh, East African football, no team has ever invested in the team the way Rwanda invested in that team since 2011. If I'm telling you how many matches they have played, if I'm telling you where they have been, they have been on World Cup in, Mes in Mexico, it's telling you that there's a huge investment behind them. And in that regard, they, they, they had the situation of uh, um, coming all out against us. We have been ready for all the challenge. Uh, we have pre prepared and done the very good scouting. We, we have in only three days succeeded to recover our players. Uh, we approach the game in the best possible way. We open uh, the scoring in 10th minute, uh, putting the opponent to come out even more, uh, controlling the game, especially there in the middle field in first half. And as it has expected, the opponent wanted to give uh, there the best, and they st started like house in fire second half. And bounce ball came on the leg of opponent, they scored the goal that was leading them to heaven time of domination. We immediately pulled the two changes that of impact players, Kiza Martin and uh, Muzamil Mutiaba, that immediately paid off because they were. Uh, all their domination has been with entrance of those two fresh leg players and players that are exactly tactically come on position where it, where it was needed. Kiza Martin giving them torrid time with Mut Muzamin Mutaba scoring the goal. Uh, we have cooled down the game up to end of the match, closing, not allowing opponent tried uh, so many things with long balls, what we have marshaled very well and we are satisfied with the result. I want to thank all the players. I want to thank uh, all the genuine football supporters in Uganda for supporting us. Uh, FUFA that has provided all the conditions for us. Technical team and all the people around uh, that they have been involved in this trip. It has been a good outing in Kigali, but in the same moment, when it's good, do not fly. When it's bad, do not give up. This is the philosophy under which I'm living together with the team. And we shall approach match very seriously next Saturday. And and uh, we believe that it will happen, it will happen uh, that we shall succeed to bring. Today is playing his last league match in Portuguese second league and is on the brink of making history entering in Premier League of Portugal, uh, Kizito Luaga, that is in this age bracket. We are looking for uh, Kasaga Richard, we are looking for uh, Yunus and Tamo, with whose club I have personal agreement that they will allow him to come. All of what I want to tell you more, we are looking uh, to approach this match the, the same like we have lost. Uh, we want to really uh, present to our supporters and I want in this to use this opportunity and to invite, invite all the supporters on Saturday to support us because this is the, and I want to call it, showroom of Ugandan football future. And uh, I strongly believe that with performance and with dedication, commitment and hard work on the field of play, we shall not disappoint whoever will come to the stadium.